Hello and welcome back to Order of Battle Winter War and Paradox Gamer playing in the next scenario here will be Summer, February 1914. After its lack of success all along the Finnish border, the Red Army has regrouped for a renewed and concentrated attack against the Mannerheim Line. And we have this pin in here. It says the Mannerheim Line remained completely intact after the Soviet offensive, allowing us to improve its defenses against future attacks. Let's get into it. So an improved Mannerheim line is what we should be looking at. Let's see how that goes. Mission briefing. After failing to penetrate the Mannerheim line in December, the Soviet army group in in the Karelian Isthmus has regrouped and received fresh reinforcements to renew its assault. This time the bulk of the Soviet forces is concentrated on a more narrow front, roughly between Mula and Suma. If they succeed in forcing a breakthrough here, the rest of the line will soon become undefendable. It appears the Soviet have realized they can beat us in battle of attrition, having access to a virtually endless pool of reserves. As such, it is imperative to not only bring the Soviet offensive to a halt, but also preserve the fighting strength of the Finnish army. So the primary objective here is to not lose the Borg, which is here. And also we need to hold three secondaries out of five. So at any given time, we have to hold three of those. Koi Visto. Suma itself, Muola, Eidaba, the airport, or airfield, and Vuoxela over here. So we can at maximum have lose two of those at any given time and still win the game. Secondary objectives aircraft damage to enemy aircraft 40. After distinguishing himself enough as fighter ace, a new air commander will be appointed. 40 points, that's a lot. Hold all secondary... Oh, actually it's not a lot, it's just 4 aircraft total. And hold all secondary VPs for 10 turns. So the same secondary VPs, if we can hold all of them for 10 turns. A determined defense of the front line will encourage High Command to send a reserve unit of, of Vickers tanks. Oh, I really like that. Okay, so I'm gonna try and hold the line. Alright, we have plenty of bunkers. And do we have any complementary forces? There is a scout plane. I see only two units. We have a Finnish Infantry 40 and another Finnish Infantry 40 with no experience. Lots of Soviet forces over here and a little bit over here as well. Okay, so Suma is going to be the key point. Let's put the heavy infantry in there to defend and flank that with some experienced infantry and some a little less experienced infantry. Also Mula. We need to hold that with some experienced infantry. Some flanks. Maybe even there. And then we need somebody up here, so let's get one in Buxala and then one over here, maybe in the woods. Like that. And then down here I'll put the engineers and they can put some mines on this road. Look at all the requisition points I have, 775. That's incredible. Then we got the T26 M39 with, with experience. Let's put it somewhere in the middle so that it can quickly move from one side to the other. 
put it here on this road. Uh, and then we have some anti-tank gun. The one that behind the line here. And I think there was one more. Did it die? Yeah, here it is. Revive that. And we'll want that over here. Like that. And now we have four, four artillery pieces, so I'll put two around here and two around here. I'll want to get some trucks on this one though. So let's put the the two medium ones. One there. One there. And then over here we'll have the light. And the heavy and also the AA gun we'll put that over here uh, maybe swap those two around like that so it'll cover everything now that we have four fighters we're gonna revive this one well, let's put them where I want to put them up here maybe. One there. One there. One there. And one here. And then we have still four air points so we can actually get a bomber. A tactical bomber. Also get that up here. So that leaves us with just one land command point and one air command point. We still got 525 points left. I feel a little bit thin over here, but I'm just gonna put some mines so that we can defend the area. Strong defense here, strong defense here, mobile defense over here, and then mostly relying on the bunkers over here as well. Soviets are gonna go first. Let's see how they do. Mortar attack. Now this bunker is gonna be destroyed. I think that's that's just part of the start game. Because there's no way you can defend that. Artillery right there. And a fighter. And conscripts. And a fighter here. And a bomber. The AA gun should defend that. No losses though. Lose two. Okay. So I need to make that artillery piece visible. And we'll do that by sending down. Is that enough? No, that's not enough. Take out this fighter. Let's see, why can we send the bomber? We can send the bomber over here. And that will make the artillery visible. Can I reach it from here? Darn it, I cannot. And I cannot reach it from there either. Reach 
my positions. Alright, I'm gonna move those guys over here then. And let's shoot out the bomber. And we have another fighter we can go down and take out. No, it won't take it out. We took eight points plus two. Okay, the bomber is not counting. Only eight fighter points did count there. Back on the ground. Punish that one. In the center. Oh, let's put some mines here. Get these guys forward. And so far we can only see the conscripts, so let's just beat them up like crap. Move forward here. Move forward there. Five damage. Goodbye. I think that's all for the turn. Yep. Soviet turn two. That fighter is out of there. Bomber's probably also gonna take a hike. Okay, fighter attack. Yeah, the bomber's out too. Winning that artillery battle. I'm gonna use my bomber to, to turn that around. There's another aircraft coming up there. And a Soviet penetration in the west. I'll just use my muddy tactics. And um, we'll be behind it. We'll take a couple of turns before we can lay more mines. There's nothing we can see here without air support. Let's get the uh, air aircraft in first then. Uh, how far can it go? It can go all the way. Three points here. Oh, they have a AA battery right there. That was a trick. Get this one over here. And now we can see something, so we can start bombing. Let's go. Like that. And over here we can start bombing his artillery. I'll also use the bomber. And they have a, a, a gun there as well. That takes him down to five. And... Take it down to four. Yeah. Nah, no effect. These guys will replenish. And replenish. And that's it for turn two. Soviet turn three. The fighter returns. Oh, they're now attacking with the heavies. The recon aircraft returns as well. That means we have cleared the skies. Okay, they're going for that town. If they can put up another guy, they might actually succeed. Here we go. Oh, he can't reach it. And of course he's gonna hammer that aircraft. 
Oh, another recon fighter. Alright. So this one is not as big a threat as it used to be. I'll get my free attack on this guy. I think I'll concentrate on bombing that one. These guys will swap places. And he will replenish. He will attack those guys. These guys will advance. Get a shot here. And then this one will just replenish back up. 10. We'll let these guys move. Or I could just go down and pluck that hole right there. Because either way he will be facing my uh, bunkers. Over here. Oh, there he is. guy's got to wait a turn. So let's send some of the fighters back. This guy for example, back to the airfield. Now where are the others? This guy, back to the airfield. Can he reach another airfield? No. I just send it up here then. And that leaves me with 7 and 7. That's good enough. Let's get some points off of this one. Oh, we see an artillery piece there. That's good news. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You still got the bomber. The bomber will not bomb that one anymore because it's too dangerous and bomb that one you also see a T26 down here and a T26 over here let's battle out this artillery piece Adjusted here. We'll just hold the line for now. I think that's it. No need to engage the T26 yet. I'll just keep. Let's see, it can move. All the way to this sector, or halfway to that sector, in one turn. Let's keep it that way. So be at turn four. Okay, those guys are going back. <laughs> Those guys <coughs> continue forward. I'll let them. <coughs> Sorry. Ah, he's still trying to get that town. I need to hold it. If I want the Vickers, I need to hold it out. I think I will do that. And they're coming up here as well. Two infantry. Three actually, that's conscripts. That just gives me more targets to shoot at. And there's artillery pieces back in action. And the recon plane is back. And the fighter over here. Alright. Also the bomber is back. Not a problem. I think we're doing okay. We still got um 
I'm still holding all five for the first four turns. I've done 28 aircraft damage. So uh, let's see if I can finish it off in the next episode. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.